Hello guys and welcome to my Convergence Zero Hour. On this video, on this video I'm gonna give you my thoughts about Aquaman. Issue number one and number two. Check that out. Well, basically the whole story goes around the fight between Aquaman and Deadshot. I have to say that the art it was pretty nice like they are and i'm talking about dead shot yes dead shot from image comics uh at least i think it is so here in metropolis uh aquaman got stuck after the dome so they found them in aquarium kind of like a a museum but where you have a different kind of fish sea creatures well someone they found it inside so that's how for him to keep himself alive because he needs salt uh, he needs salt water so you can see they are and this is the aquaman with captain hook he has no hand so this is the era from the zero hours so basically it's more or less the introduction of the character of Metropolis, what and how he went through, how it become kind of like a, the Star Labs kind of kind of like protecting him in a way from the, from the police. As you can see here. Okay. Sorry about the glare. So the voice comes up, as you can see here. Look at that. So basically, he had to fight Deadshot. The thing is that Deadshot, he managed to get inside of Star Labs, going through all the security and mission and lockup and all that stuff. I know. So, so he finally goes inside of Star Labs, searching for Aquaman. They have to battle each other. Now the issue has has a lot of a lot of blood and action. The story was more or less it was a good story. It was it's nothing like to go overboard. And the fight between Aquaman and Deadshot starts. The thing is that like Star Lab, like Batman has a condition uh, contingency plan in case that they could not uh, just in case that Aquaman he went crazy so Star Lab had a way to stop Aquaman but the thing is that Deadshot from his earth has also an Aquaman so he read the file how to destroy Aquaman and all the superheroes because on his world his job is to kill superheroes that anybody that nobody dares to kill for whatever reason that he has to kill those superheroes that he's he's hired to do so it's kind of like it's a mission between punisher and Deathstroke. kind of he's a gun for hire or in this case knife and gun for hire <laughs> So, the thing is that he get into the computer frame on Star Labs and he activated the contingency plans. The contingency plan is bringing uh, kind of like a, like a hero. The type of hero that you have in your house on winter, on winter time, same thing. So the heat is what affects Aquaman, even though the Aquaman, he, his skin is, is pretty tough, he's bulletproof. So the thing is that he also figured out how to survive. And as you can see here, the thing about this shot is that he, he don't die. You can break his neck, a few minutes later he will he will recover and go back to action. You can actually kill him. 
and he's still going to come back to life. So Aquaman, what he did with his hook, he stabbed it in, on the neck, on his neck. So because of it, Aquaman, he gets, uh, he gets soaked with death stroke, I mean death shot blood. And we know that the blood has water and salt. What that woman needs to survive or to recover his strength. So by getting soaked using this stroke blood, well, he's recovered himself. I didn't see that coming. Believe it or not, yeah, it might be a little bit nasty, but hey, it worked. So in Aquaman's mind, even though it's a little bit nasty, it did work. So by defeating this uh, death shot, he vanished and his city vanished, which means that Aquaman won the fight. And the city that lost, well, just vanished. The thing is that the story continues on in Convergence issue number seven. What happened? Because now he had to fight someone else, which I don't know. I mean, I know more. That will be some other video. So basically, overall, it was a simple story. Nothing, nothing special. A lot of action, blood, punching, kicking, fighting, biting, poking eyes, breaking bones. So overall, it was a okay story, and I would give it. Uh, I would give it four out of five. Yeah, I would. I would give it four. It was okay. Nothing special there. Eh. So, well, guys, this is it. I hope that you like this video. Till later. Bye.